am Amanda Honig here to talk to you about wearables. So wearable technology, as the name implies, is technology that you can wear. Why you would want a wearable device versus a handheld device is because it can make a worker hands-free. If I have a heavy picking use case, for example, where I'm moving a lot of packages, instead of having a traditional handheld computer where I might scan the box and then now I have to pick the box up uh, and put it on the shelf, right? It makes that process a little more cumbersome, especially if I'm doing that intensively throughout the entire day. Whereas if I have a wearable device, um, a wearable scanner, I can easily just grab and go. So it's more comfortable for me on the user, and it also makes workers more productive. Zebra's really been a pioneer in this wearable space. I know it's been a trending topic from smartwatches of recently, but we've been doing this for over a decade now and have a broad portfolio of wearable solutions that can help our customers be more productive and pick orders more efficiently and improve customer operations. If we start with the WT6300, this is a dedicated wearable mobile computer. It's a multimodal solution as well. So you have a full mobile computer, large screen, you can run multiple applications, and it's intended for use cases where the picking is very intense, the need to be hands-free all day is required. So that's why it's a dedicated wearable terminal. Then we have what we call hybrid wearable solutions, like what I'm wearing here with the TC53, TC58. This is a handheld that's sitting in a wearable wrist mount, just like my TC52 here. So I can easily pop that out, and when I need to be wearable, I'll use the wrist mount, but there might not be a need to be wearable all the time. I have users that need to use it as a handheld, but they don't need a full dedicated wearable mobile computer all the time, so they have a hybrid option. Next, we have the WS50. So this is our all-in-one wearable mobile computer. So this is literally taking a mobile computer and converging the data capture so it's an all-in-one device. This is great for task-specific applications where a user just has to do intense scanning and they only need limited interaction with their display. So they don't need a full screen like what you have on the WT6300, that'd be overkill in those use cases. In addition, I mentioned the hybrid wearable. We have the wrist mount that it can mount on and then for scanning, you could pair a Bluetooth wearable scanner. This is the RS6100. This comes with a extended range scanner. So I could scan out to 40 feet and I can also operate in freezer temperatures. But if you don't need freezer, we also have the RS5100. Kind of the same form factor, only with a standard range engine that doesn't read out as far. The common theme here is that Zebra has different options so that as a customer, you can pick the solution that's going to meet the needs of your use case, whether that's dedicated wearable, whether that's a hybrid wearable, pairing a wearable scanner, and whether that's a all-in-one solution. Plus, we give you the options on the most comfortable wearability for your users. That's one of the bigger hurdles when you're deploying wearables is, is my user gonna be comfortable wearing the solution? They have many different options and they can be easily washed, easily cleaned, so it keeps everything nice and hygienic and you can buy spare parts and give each user their own wearable piece so that they're comfortable having to wear that technology throughout the day. So that's an overview of the entire wearable portfolio from Zebra.